Boy, you had a nice time in Brazil, huh, Saquon? That worked. Uh, yeah, yeah, it was pretty fun. I would say, um, you know, going out there uh, and getting the win uh, probably was the best part. But finally, be able to put on that Eagles jersey and um, go out there and um, have fun, play at a high level, and you know, looking forward to building that. Now, I'm sure it's just it's everything is different, obviously, uh, professionally for you in terms of where you're playing and the uniform color that you're in, and and then you go out and a in a stadium you've never been? I don't know if you've ever been to the Southern Hemisphere in your life. Is that a first trip for you to Brazil? No, I've been to, I've been to Rio one time. Okay. Uh, I got to go there during Carnival. Ooh. So I got to see the culture and um, how beautiful the place is and had some fun. This one was a little more of a business trip. Right. Um, and, you know, I think we handled business. Well, you had your own Carnival. How does that sound? You held your own. Um, yeah, for sure. So, because it looks, you you look comfortable in it, Saquon. Is is that an accurate description? You're already comfortable in this offense in Philadelphia. Um, yeah, yeah. I would say that. I would say definitely uh, comfortable. Um, going back watching film, uh, felt like that. Uh, even though I had a, a a great game and we had a great game of offense, we still left a lot out there. So, um, that's why I look forward to the most is improving on that. Um, and you know, fixing up the little things and locking in on details and. Uh, getting ready for Monday night. What'd you leave out there? I don't. We left uh, right after. Uh, you know, won the game, did interviews, got on the bus, right to the flight. No, what did you leave out there? You said you left a lot out there. What did you leave out there? I didn't see much uh, left out there, Saquon. But I'm not an all twenty two guy. You know. Yeah. <laughs> um, my fault. Uh, but yeah, some some big runs. Uh, you know, there was one run that come to mind where uh, if I probably just keep going right. Uh, I get a lot more yards, uh, but like you said, I don't have uh, the, that vision, um, the whole field right there, uh, so I can improve on that. And just in the game, um, you know, whether it's in the system, making a guy miss here and there, or keep my feet driving and instead of a three-yard game, you know, could have been a seven, eight-yard game, um, could have did better in a four-minute drill, I felt like. Um, but those are all little things that, you know, when you go back, you got to have, you got to be critical of yourself because even in a win, you got to find little things you can prove on because, those are things that come back to uh, bite you and you know what later on in the season. So how does this offense suit you in a way that your previous ones perhaps did not, Saquon? Um, I think, uh, you know, I think one, when you look on the field, is A.J. Brown, Dallas Goddard, Devontae Smith, uh, Jalen Hurt, Jahan Dotson. You know, the list goes on and on. Uh, you know, right then and there, there's so many guys you got to worry about and prepare for. Uh, so that just helps. Um, but also Kellen and all the guys on the offense staff do a really good job, not only with myself, uh, but putting us in a position to uh, be successful, win our one-on-one matchups. And that's what the NFL is all about, you know, winning your one-on-ones and making the plays when the plays come to you. And I was able to do that um, on Friday in Brazil, and hopefully I can continue to do that the rest of the season. Well, not just to, not to give away any anything from the playbook, but uh, or, or, like what, what, if you don't mind sharing, have you told Kellen Moore or Coach Sirianni that you're comfortable doing this and it's in the playbook? If not before, um, I mean, for my mindset, what I told him from the second that I got here, and you know, I've said it in the media, and I said to the team, I, I feel like that I can do pretty much anything on the football field. I can run any scheme. I feel like I can catch the ball. Um, I struggled in the pass pro in the beginning of my career. I feel like my pass pro has improved. Um, so whatever they need me to do, uh, I feel like I'm able to do. Um, and that's kind of the mindset that I have. And they gave me opportunities in camps to show that. So, um, and also in off season training with Jalen and training with the guys and OTAs, just building those reps with each other and building the confidence. So when you got there on, on Sundays or Fridays or Mondays, um, or Thursdays, um, it just all comes natural. Catch the Rich Eisen show every single day on the Roku channel, 12 to three Eastern for free. 